Hello and welcome to another video. If you're watching this video, I know you're gonna like it. So just give it a like. Just push the like button. Let's get into the video. So what you have here is a system of equations and you're supposed to find x and y. But um, uh, it is not a set of linear equations so we cannot do elimination and what can we do? This has x and the exponents. You can't apply any law of exponents because the um, exponents are not the same and the bases too are not the same. Uh, what should we do? What shall we do? Let's do substitution. So if you look at the second equation, you can actually isolate x and say um, x is equal to 5 minus y or you say y equals 5 minus x. Whichever one you want to take first, that's fine. So from this part, we can say um, y equals 5 minus x and now that I've isolated my y I will take this 5 minus x and replace this y here so I have an exponential equation containing only x so I can rewrite the first equation and say 2 to the x multiplied by 3 to the 5 minus x is equal to 4 okay now how do we solve this now this can be solved okay we might just need to employ some logarithms to be able to bring down the exponents but um, what does this expression mean it means 2 to the x multiplied by 3 to the 5 divided by 3 to the x okay you see that you know what I can drag this under this and we can rewrite this expression as 2 to the x divided by 3 to the x multiplied by 3 to the 5 is equal to 4. Well, let's plug in. Let's apply the law of exponent here. When you have 2 to the x over 3 to the x, when the exponents are the same, you can just isolate the exponent and say so you write it this way to the x multiplied by 3 to the fifth will be 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Whoa, that's 81 times 3, and that's 243. So we can multiply this by 243 equals 4. But we can divide both sides by 243, so you have 2 to the x, sorry, 2 over 3 to the x equals 4 over 243. And now, how do we get x? Well, let's introduce logarithm. We can take the log of both sides, the log of 2 over 3, to the x will be equal to the log of 4 over 2, 43. And now we can drop this down and say x log 2 over 3 equals the logarithm of 4 over 2, 43. And we can isolate x and say x is equal to this divided by this, which will be log 4 over 2, 43 divided by log 2 over 3. And you could take this as your answer, and you can decide to apply the laws of logarithm here and break this down into the tiny pieces. You know, you can simplify this. This would be log 4 minus log 243, or you can say, so this is acceptable. This is a good answer. Okay, and you can also say that your answer is um, x equals, we can write log 4 minus log 243 divided by log 2 minus log 3. Well, you know you can rewrite this as 2 to the power of 2. You can rewrite this as um, 3 to the power of 5 and then bring down the exponent. So we can rewrite this and say this is log 2 squared minus log 3 to the 5 over log 2 minus log 3 which if you bring this down will give you x equals 2 log 2 minus 5 log 3 over log 2 minus log 3. This is another way to present your answer. So whether you want your answer this way or you want to write it this way in the expanded form, that's on you. Never stop learning. Those who stop learning have stopped living. Bye-bye.